Hey guys, today is Tuesday, March 9th, and we're going ELA, and we're going to talk about um, mints, which are just when do I capitalize a word. So today we're going to do some revising on our essays, our order and sequence essays. So the first thing you want to do is get out your order and sequence essay, okay? Pause the video if you need to, get out your order and sequence essay. It'll be in docs. All right, M is for months. Always capitalize months, days of the week, and holidays. Examples are January, March, Ramadan, Christmas, and Thursday. I, when it's by itself, when you use I to describe yourself, capitalize it. I went to school. When I is by itself, capitalize it. Capitalize it. When I is by itself, make sure it's a capital. If it's an adult, it lives by itself, it has to be an adult. Okay? Capitalize your eyes when they're by themselves. Names and other proper nouns. Always capitalize names and other proper nouns. Capitalize names of people, countries, states, awards, companies, so Hall of Fame, American Country Music Award, Anna, Malala, Argentina, Ohio, Sam, Wendy's, any of those, you're going to capitalize them. Okay, names of places and people, cities. So your person that you're doing your essay on, their name should always be capitalized. Okay, their person, the name of your person should always be capitalized every time you use it. Titles. So always capitalize titles. Titles of books, movies, songs, and articles. I am Malala, Tangled, Divergent, Aladdin, Let It Snow. Titles of anything, you're going to capitalize them, okay? Sentence. The first word in your sentence should always be capitalized, okay? First word in your sentence should always be capitalized. A fish ran up the wall. A bus flew to the moon. Okay, make sure the first word is, the first letter of the first word is always capitalized. My example is my nephew's name is Luke. Okay? All right, so review. M, months, days, and holidays, like Ramadan and March. Letter I, the letter. I went to school. Names, Sam, Alex, Spain. Start of sentences. My nephew's name is Luke. T, titles like Aladdin and Tangled. I like Disney, sorry y'all. All right, it's your turn. So after I read this slide, I want you to go to your writing that you should have already put up at the beginning. Make sure you capitalize the start of every sentence. Check your names of people, of words, places. If they were born in Brooklyn, New York, capitalize Brooklyn and New York. You wanna capitalize the state, the city, the country, okay? Check that every single I is capitalized, okay? I when it's by itself. Go ahead and pause the video and do that now. All right, you're gonna pause again and indent. So to indent, you're gonna click right here, right beside the first letter. And then you're gonna hit the tab button. So the tab button is gonna be on the left of your keyboard. So you're gonna click right here right beside the word can and you're going to end it by clicking tab okay go ahead and pause this again and do that the first uh, word of every paragraph should be indented every paragraph so your introduction should be indented just like this then your first body paragraph that early life fame life after fame Conclusion. Those should all be indented, okay? Indented. Proper nouns we talked about. Go make sure that all of your proper nouns are capitalized, okay? All of those names. Make sure they're capitalized. Go now. Pause the video. Go ahead. So these are what proper nouns are. Proper nouns are unique names given to specific people, places, or things such as a ward, Awards, organizations, and song titles. So Michael Jordan, he is, that's his name. That is a proper noun. Capitalize it. Okay. Brooklyn, New York. Capitalize it. Potasco, Ohio. Capitalize it. Okay. Um, the NAACP. 
NBA, capitalize those, okay? Organizations, they should be capitalized. Okay, pause the video again if you need to and go do that. Again, this is in your order and sequence essay. Make sure all of it, all of your proper nouns, those unique names are capitalized. All right, make sure you use transition words. You are gonna be graded for transition words. Okay, these are words that link or connect ideas, phrases, sentences, and paragraphs. These words help the reader smoothly through ideas by creating a bridge between them, okay? Use first, then, also, finally, furthermore, next, additionally, later, lastly, okay? Or you can use some on these lists, on this list here, okay? Or you can Google it, okay? If you're like, I can't think of any, Google it. Search transition words, okay? Make sure you add at least two for every paragraph, okay? Please, please, please put them in. Pause the video and go do that. Okay? You need to watch the video again to make sure you have all of it edited. Make sure also to read through your essay. Make sure your sentences make sense. Don't just say, 1924 died. What? Okay, make sure they are complete sentences. Make sure that they make sense. Read them out loud if you need to. I always think that helps my writing to read it out loud. Okay? You guys can do this. Watch the video again if you need to. Have a wonderful day.